What's up, entrepreneurs? Sherwin here. And let me tell you something. Michael E. Gerber's is not just a book. It's a damn manifesto. It's a wake-up call for anyone who's ever dreamt of building something incredible. You ready to crush it? We're diving deep into the nitty-gritty of building a business from the ground up. We're talking passion, vision, and execution. So buckle up, because we're about to break this down Gary V style. Look, everyone wants to talk about building the next unicorn, but nobody wants to talk about the grunt work. Gerber nails it in chapter one. You gotta have a vision. And I'm not talking about some vague idea you scribbled on a napkin. This is about your why. Why are you doing this? What gets you fired up in the morning? That's how you stay motivated when the going gets tough. This is bigger than you, got it? Gerber drops some serious knowledge bombs in this chapter. He's talking about the four personalities of entrepreneurship, the dreamer, the thinker, the storyteller, and the leader. This is about understanding your strengths, recognizing your weaknesses, and surrounding yourself with people who complement your skill set. You need all four of these personalities firing on all cylinders to build a business that can truly dominate. Ideas are a dime a dozen. Everybody's got an idea for the next big thing. But what separates the dreamers from the doers? Action. This chapter is all about turning those late night brainstorming sessions into a concrete plan. What's your customer journey look like? What are your distribution channels? You need a roadmap, people. The more detailed your plan, the better equipped you'll be to navigate the inevitable challenges that come with building a business. Chapter four, kicking fear to the curb. No time for doubt. Listen up, entrepreneurs. Fear is a liar. It's the voice in the back of your head telling you you're not good enough, that your idea will never work. But here's the thing about fear. It's a bully. And you know what happens to bullies? You stand up to them. Gerber gives you the tools you need to confront your fears head on. Remember your why. Tap into that inner fire and don't let anything hold you back. Chapter 5. Systematize your way to freedom. Work smarter, not harder. Want to be a slave to your business? No? Then you better get on board with this systematization thing. You need to create systems and processes that can run without you. Think of it like building a machine. Each part needs to work seamlessly with the others for the whole thing to function properly. This is about documenting your processes, training your team, and creating a business that can run on autopilot. That's how you free yourself up to focus on the big picture, the vision, the strategy, the growth. Chapter six, the customer is king. Build something they actually want. Too many entrepreneurs get caught up in their own heads. Don't be that person. Gerber stresses the importance of a customer-centric approach. This is about understanding your target audience, listening to their needs, and building a business that solves their problems. That's how you build a loyal following, a tribe of raving fans who will not only buy from you again and again, but who will also tell everyone they know about you. Chapter seven, the entrepreneurial life. It's a marathon, not a sprint. Look, building a business is not for the faint of heart. It's a grind, a hustle, a constant learning curve, but it's also the most rewarding thing you'll ever do. Gerber leaves you with a powerful message. Entrepreneurship is a way of life. So stay curious, stay hungry, and never stop pushing yourself to be better. Outro, now go build your empire. That's it, entrepreneurs. We just scratched the surface of Michael E. Gerber's. If you haven't already, go get yourself a copy. It's a game changer. And while you're at it, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and ring that notification bell so you don't miss out on any future videos. Now, get out there and start building